Well, I'm in Yoder, Kansas. Yoder is basically an Amish Mennonite community of about 165 people. And I always say about in these small communities because births and deaths can change the demographics a lot. Well, hey y'all, welcome to Yoder, Kansas. If you don't subscribe and like, we can still take a hike. Subscribe and like, subscribe and like, subscribe and like. And this is Yoder Heritage Days. We're going to have a lot of fun. Come on, let's go and check it out. So how can anyone begin a festival without a parade? Yoder's parade is a little different. The horses lead off in grand style. Now usually horses come at the end of the parade for, well, obvious reasons. But not today. The lead horses trotted out and we all stood in honor of the national anthem. I love small town America. Well, they were followed by two young 12-year-old lady riders who are not Amish. These young women are amazing, and you'll see that later. Then another group of riders came up the street. These are one of the main reasons I wanted to come to Heritage Days. This group is an Amish drill team. Yep, I said that right. An Amish drill team and I'll share their demonstration later as well. This year, they're involved in fun shows, parades, trail rides, all kinds of fun stuff. What a neat rig, neat old buckboard. Yeah, Saturday mornings, give, giving carriage rides. Sierra and Marnita, yeah, David Rock coming. Antique tractors were crowd pleasers with this farming audience. There are so many events all day long, buggy races, tractor pulls, music, displays, craft sales. I met people from across Kansas, Oklahoma, Minnesota, the Amish riders of the United Hoofbeats drill team, they're from Ohio. Well, the Flannelbacks is a group of young men from Newton, Kansas, and they play bluegrass and, and just good old mountain music. There was an auction. I love to hear the auction. The, the buggy races was such fun to watch. Okay, first horse up, Delbert and Mike. These characters get together. Drop of the flag. They are on the loose. To watch them have so much fun racing one another. The one has broke stride. They are both pacers. It's a side of, of the Amish community that I had not ever thought about. <laughs> Good These two 12-year-old young ladies that they're known as the Pegasus Riders, uh, talented. <laughs> how I would as a, as a dad feel about my girl getting on these horses and riding upside down like this this young lady does. They are gifted and talented and, and I'm glad that they're as brave as they are. Much braver than I am. <laughs> then the United Hoofbeats took the stage. These young men and women can ride horses. They were from the Amish community in Ohio.
beautiful horses, very talented riders. And the people loved it. They sat around and watched and cheered. See the people enjoying themselves, caring for one another. It's the people, always the people that make it so much fun. It's been a full day here in Yoder. Uh, glad you came along. It's been a lot of fun. Till next time, stay safe, stay healthy, stay on the path. God bless you.